All right, so where does division fit into the order of operations? Well, again, the fundamental rule of order of operations, all operations go from left to right unless there's a grouping symbol or we have an operation with higher precedence. Again, addition and subtraction have equal precedence. Neither is done before the other. The default left to right then applies. Division has a higher precedence, so it gets done before addition and subtraction. Division and multiplication also have the same precedence. So if I have a division and I have a multiplication, I don't have higher precedence. And if I don't have a grouping symbol, my default left to right procedure is going to be what holds. So for example, let's try and place parentheses to make this statement that involves division, multiplication, addition, and subtraction. We want to make that true. And again, identify the type of expression. The last thing we do is going to be the type of expression that we have. So again, maybe there are no parentheses. So let's evaluate that. So let's see, I have division, I have multiplication. So if there are no parentheses, I do those things first and from left to right. So the division is first, that's six. Then my multiplication, one times four, that's four. I have addition and subtraction. I'm gonna do those left to right. So I do four plus six first, then I subtract. I get six, which is not what I want. So the statement isn't true, so I need to throw in some parentheses. And I'll try out various combinations. So maybe the 4 plus 12 is in parentheses. So parentheses take highest priority. Stuff inside parentheses gets done first. I have division and multiplication. They're equal precedent, so I'm going to take care of those left to right. And still not true. So where else can I place parentheses? Well, maybe I'll throw them around the 2 minus 1. So again, parentheses do this first. And so parentheses 2 minus 1 is 1. And here I have multiplication and division. They have equal precedence. So I'm going to work these from left to right. I do divide by 1, then times 4. Divide by 1 times 4. Finally, I add and still not what I want. Well, let's say two sets of parentheses, 4 plus 12, divide by 2 minus 1 times 4. So I'll try it out. 4 plus 12, parentheses say do things first. That's 16. That's 1. And again, division followed by multiplication. They have equal precedence, so I'm going to go from left to right. And still not what I want. Well, here's another possibility we haven't tried before. Maybe our parentheses are inside parentheses. So here's what we call nested parentheses. And that is certainly a possibility. So reading this parentheses day, do stuff inside first. Well, inside, there's another set of parentheses. So do stuff inside first. So that 2 minus 1 has to be done first. Then times 4 is inside parentheses. So I have to do that first. And then divide and plus divide has higher precedence. 4 plus 3 is 7, and that finally works. And again, the last thing I did was add, so this expression is a sum.